Okay, so this is the part that I've really wanted to see because I want to see a screen rest like I've never seen before on these uprights. So I'm gonna call the guys in and let's just see how easy this is. All right guys, let's bring it in. And that's it. No legs, no problems, locking it on the bottom and then they'll raise it up. Hey, that looks, that looks great, Josh. Yeah, that's perfect. So that's it. It was that simple. Walked in, put it up. They've now floated the drape line behind the screen so it's not touching. This is not, uh, this is not a skirt or a valance on the top or bottom. Right. No legs. No legs. We don't have room back here for the legs. Right, right. There, there's stuff back here. We just don't have the ability to put up the whole frame structure in this instance. Right. So it just makes sense for us to put up a screen with the minimal footprint and still have it nice and blacked out behind it, a nice line to the wall and it's just a really nice clean look. Well, and you've also saved 25 minutes of labor time of building the legs, screwing the screen up, standing the screen, putting the arms on. So you've saved a lot of time and labor yeah. costs as well. And this is really sturdy. Yeah. Uh, you know, obviously we sandbagged our uprights, right. which you do anyway, right. but also we're locked into that uh, socket up at the top. When you need to get away from the legs, you don't have the room for them or whatever, you want a nice clean look. A perfect example is a drape line behind a stage where you need to put a smaller uh, uh, image magnification screen right. above the stage. You need to get it above everybody's head, you need to center it on the stage, but you can't have any legs on the stage because you've got talent walking around right. and you don't have a truss maybe to hang it from. This is a perfect solution. You use the, use the drape line that you're going to put up anyway. So next, we're going to talk about banners and look at signage and how the Versatop is going to interact with that. So that's what we're doing next. Thanks.